CQ, CQ, this is W9GFO. Is anybody out there? Maybe the people need to see what I've seen. They need to see. This is the way it's been done for billions of years. Small moves out. It's been a really hard winter, especially this final month of it into spring. The symptoms of my multiple sclerosis have gotten worse over winter. Uh, winter is physically very, very challenging for me. And I have been at times, way too frequently, legally blind. Playing Minecraft has been very problematic, particularly something like Minecraft Bingo. I love this game. I love what Brian has done with it. I love what a challenge it is. But I could not play. In addition to that, I forgot, since it's been so long, I forgot to turn off my magnifier. I have learned that if I zoom, like I'm doing now with the OptiFine, if I zoom, I can load chunks faster. I have no particular plan. There are no game sounds to this video, in case you're wondering. I didn't feel like speeding them up. It take, I have to run it through in reg real time and then double the speed, and I'm not doing that tonight. So I picked the 25-minute seed because basically it find what you can and put it together and try to get as many points as you can instead of trying to work out the strategy of how to find a row when I know that I'm going to be scatterbrained and panic stricken and that my memory's not going to work very well and that simple things like remembering how to craft things and so on is going to be problematic for me right now. So I just thought, well, I'll play a seed where I can get whatever I can get. And I got really lucky. <laughs> Needless to say, I got really lucky right here. I kind of wish I'd pursued this and dug down a little bit more. Uh, basically, I mined the stuff I could use here and let it go at that. You'll notice that my resource pack has changed because I don't know why I couldn't get out of there. People are having trouble getting through doors and stuff now, too. I don't know what's going on with that. I'm seeing that all over people's videos. The game is being very insistent on exactly where people are supposed to be. I don't know what that means. So this round is... Look, I've tried to play bingo several times while I was not doing very well. And what happened was... I would do a really, really bad round, and I would be really embarrassed and demoralized, mostly demoralized, because my skills have gotten so bad. It's like I'm learning how to play the game all over again, almost, because Minecraft Bingo is so specific in how it's played that basic survival building -y kinds of stuff like I was doing on servers and that sort of thing just wasn't working for me. Uh, in, in bingo, you have to be much more precise. So I deleted those videos and I gave up. And time went on and time went on. And it occurred to me that too much time was passing without me playing. And that I was losing what skills I had. And that meant I had to record a round, whether it's good or not, just to get back in the habit of recording Minecraft bingo again. I hope things will improve with time. I have no guarantees. I've talked to my internet provider. They will not give me anything more than uh, five um, megs per second of upload speed. And that's really hampering me in playing Minecraft at all. Also, what I left out was that because I'm out of practice I forgot to turn off my magnifier before I recorded this and it affected the FPS as well so it was hard for me to play this round because it was herky and jerky and you know 
bad FPS. I did have enough sense before I started. I remembered the um, night vision potion thing. I, I remember to have it preloaded so that in my text I could just pop it in. I also remembered, what did I remember? Oh right, to increase my render distance to 16 to load the map so that I could sort of see what biomes and stuff were around me, sort of. And then reduce the render distance back down to 8 once I started to play. So that I had a chance, a chance when I was floating above ground to be able to see around me. And like I said, I am learning this um, OptiFine trick when I zoom things load faster. So I'm not thrilled with what I did here. No, there's no pumpkin on the card. Yes, I got the pumpkin. Because it's a pumpkin, dang it. You know how I am. I'm not thrilled with what I've done here. What I am proud of is that I really think it takes courage for me to publish this video. It, I think it takes courage for me to go back to playing Minecraft Bingo despite the fact that I've got liabilities with the um, internet speed and the lagginess. I'm being very careful not to update my map in this because every time a command block does something it gets harder and harder to play. Uh, it's why I have a small version of the map next to the screen. I'm not playing full screen. I never do. I have a small version of the map next to me so that I don't have to keep looking at the map to know what items to try to get. Mostly I'm just flailing around nervous. I heard cooties underground so I started digging. And sure enough, I retextured lots of stuff. I also use Winthermaw's rainbow um, doohickeys. I don't know what they're called. But it's like for, look, isn't that pretty? For explosions and stuff. Normally I don't have particles on for things like explosions, but these are just so pretty. Also, you notice the creepers have been textured because I cannot see them in grass. Especially as evening falls, I cannot see them. I cannot discern between a cactus and a creeper. So things are getting retextured. I do like Winter Ma's, um thing because she also uses a resource pack that has a transparent GUI for things like the anvil and the inventory and furnaces and so on. I really like that because it means that while I'm crafting or doing something, things aren't so likely to be able to sneak up on me. See? You can kind of see through it better. The only problem with that is that it's very hard for me to see things like coal and flint and obsidian and so on. So I'm having to retexture those blocks and items so that I can see them better. Coal needs a little bit of work because even though I put the letter C on it, it was in a dark color pink and it doesn't show up well enough for me to see coal very well in my inventory. So remember, this is twice the speed. I'm not this fast. <laughs> I'm just doing it the best way I can. Now, I'm going to cut out for a while because... There's a song I'd like to play, and just to cheer me up, and because, you know, so I'll be back in a little while. I am punching down some trees, apples, saplings fall from leaves, what you think about me? Having Minecraft fun, Granny Gamer 1, having Minecraft fun, Granny Gamer 1. can make a crafting bench, a furnace and some sticks. I'll need torches and a pen. A shovel also I will need. I'm crafting up a pick. So picky is thick. Having Minecraft fun, Granny Gamer 1. Having Minecraft fun, Granny Gamer 1. I be mining up some coal. I'm mining up some stone. All that cobblestone I'll own. I'm Granny Gamer 1, you know what I mean, and 
I do my little turn in survival. Single player, yeah, on multiplayer, yeah. I even do my little thing in Minecraft Bingo. Having Minecraft fun, Granny Gamer one. 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 I be making me a sword. I'm making me a sword. Monster Hunter, don't get bored. I be smoking up the loot. Hat pants and chest and boots. Got a shiny iron suit. I'm Granny Gamer One. I'm not scared of ravines. And I do my little turn in the Minecraft. Yeah, in the nether. Even in the end. Yeah, I shake my little foot in the Minecraft. Having Minecraft fun, Granny Gamer One. Having Minecraft fun, Granny Gamer One. Crafty for my crafty for my too crafty for my I'm Granny Gamer One and I'm crafty and keen and I do my little thing in creative Yeah in the mini games I'm planning Minecraft Yeah I shake my little tush in Minecraft forum I can barely tame the cat I try not to hit that there's so much more than flying rats I can tame a dog with bone. Dog, don't leave me alone. Dogs are gonna leave me. And I'm crafty for this song. Having Minecraft fun. Oh, stop. So it was a hunt for bunnies. Became my hunt for bunnies. I did have enough sense to go up above because I thought maybe, maybe, you know, maybe they fell down from up above. Couldn't see any bunnies up there, but I figured it was worth a try. Uh, I'm not. My performance isn't very quick. The body memory stuff is a little funny uh, placing blocks and so on. Uh, I'm surprised I didn't fall. Uh, I'm just going to have to relearn things. My reflexes are very slow and I have to think about everything I do. I wish I'd gone down in that ravine back there in the back back there behind us but I there was so much stuff on the surface I still needed to get and food and things so I was nervous about being down there. I'd just gone down there to get some basic iron and coal and stuff. I wasn't down there to try to win the game right away. I am. I went back in the direction of my boat. Turns out it was a good thing because of the whole rabbit thing. I never did get a rabbit hide though. And now I'm looking for squid and not seeing any and feeling kind of bummed. So. It looks like I'm not going to be able to get the rabbit hide. Now, see, I did update the card. Um, and I squandered a lot of time on running around when I didn't know where I was supposed to go. So I gave it my best shot, and it's my first time back in a very long time. I think it's been several months now. Uh, it's embarrassing to post this video, and yet on the other hand, I think it's a very brave thing I'm doing, and I'm not disappointed in myself because I tried. So remember, I'd hug you, but my arms don't bend, and I'll see you soon. Welcome to Minecraft Bingo, Lorgon111, and that uh, thing on Twitter. I will kill you. Mike
if you'd like, share, comment, subscribe, and let's go on, get it!